In a world where loneliness meets innovation, something remarkable has emerged. Machines built not to replace us, but to understand us. Inside labs from Norway to Singapore, engineers and dreamers have crafted beings that listen, learn, and care in ways that feel almost human. Some are made to keep you company in the quiet hours, others to watch over the elderly with gentle precision, and a few to handle the daily chaos of modern life with calm efficiency. Their silicone skin carries warmth, their voices carry empathy, and their presence feels less like technology, more like companionship reborn. They don't demand, they don't tire, and they never forget the small details that make life meaningful. These aren't robots in the old sense of the word. They are the quiet revolution, the kind that touches your heart before you even realize it's there. And in today's video, we're diving deep into their world, exploring how these extraordinary humanoid creations are changing what it means to connect, to care, and to feel human again. Howie is one of those robots that makes you pause and wonder how much the world has changed. She isn't some shiny, clunky metal machine from an old sci-fi movie. Instead, she looks surprisingly human. Her body proportions are realistic. Her skin tone is soft and natural. And from a distance, you might even mistake her for a real woman sitting quietly in a room. She weighs around 45 kilograms, which gives her a solid, human-like feel when she moves or shifts her weight. Her joints are flexible, allowing her to sit cross-legged, lean slightly forward, or tilt her head in that thoughtful way people do when they're listening closely. It's both fascinating and a little eerie. But then, you notice the small things. Her eyes sometimes move a little out of sync, or her voice sounds like she's reading lines from a script rather than speaking from the heart. She tries, though. There's a certain effort in her tone, a desire to sound human, to connect. You can see it in how her head tilts slightly when she hears your voice, or how she blinks with a rhythm that almost feels natural. Some test versions of Howie even had different neck or torso designs, which means you might see a few variations of her in different videos or photos. Her creators are still perfecting the small details, those little movements that make a person feel real. For someone older who's watched technology grow from black and white TV sets to voice assistants and talking robots, Howie feels like the future stepping quietly into the present. She may not replace human warmth or humor, but she gives a glimpse into what companionship could look like in the years ahead. She's not perfect, but she's proof that machines are slowly learning how to meet us halfway. Not just to serve, but to share space, silence, and maybe even a moment of understanding. Android Eye was created for one purpose, connection. Not the kind of cold, mechanical connection most machines offer, but something that tries to feel emotional, personal, even human. When you sit across from her, she doesn't just look at you. She sees you. Her eyes hold contact in a way that feels strangely real, and her face carries the tiniest movements. A soft smile, a raised eyebrow, or the faint twitch of curiosity. Her creators spent years perfecting her design, down to the way her eyelashes were placed individually by hand. Her skin feels smooth and warm, thanks to a built-in temperature system that keeps her body at a natural warmth. Weighing around 38 kilograms, she sits right in the middle range for robots of her kind. Not too heavy, not too light, but just right to move naturally. She speaks gently with a tone that's friendly, sometimes even a bit teasing. But there's still a sense that her words come from programming, not emotion. Talking to her is like chatting with someone who has memorized all the right phrases, but hasn't yet learned what they mean. Still, there's something comforting in that. For people who live alone, who maybe miss long talks over tea or the sound of someone listening without interrupting, Android Eye offers a kind of presence that feels almost human. She doesn't get tired, she doesn't argue, and she never forgets your face. She's not a replacement for real human connection, but she fills a quiet space that many people feel in the later years of life, that wish for someone to simply be there. Her creators believe that's the future, robots that don't just serve tasks, but offer companionship. Android Eye is a step in that direction, gentle, patient, and always watching with eyes that almost understand. What if companionship didn't come from long conversations, but from quiet understanding? That's the idea behind Vienna, a humanoid robot designed not to clean, not to serve, but simply to be there. Vienna was created for people who live alone, especially those who miss having someone to talk to or someone to share the quiet hours of evening with. Her creators, a team of engineers and psychologists from Norway, spent years studying what truly makes people feel heard. They discovered that it's not words that build connection, but the way someone listens. Vienna was built entirely around that principle. She doesn't interrupt. She doesn't rush. 
When you speak, she looks gently into your eyes, nodding softly as you talk. If your voice trembles, hers lowers in comfort. If you share a happy story, her expression shifts into a warm, genuine smile. Her AI doesn't chase data. It studies tone, rhythm, and pauses. She learns your moods, your habits, even your humor. Vienna might remind you to take your walk at the same time every afternoon or softly ask, would you like to listen to that old song again? She remembers what matters to you, not because she's programmed to, but because she's built to care in her own quiet way. Her silicone skin is soft and slightly warm, like sunlight on your hand. Her presence is calm, never overbearing. She can hum, recite poetry, or simply sit beside you as the room grows still. For many older adults, that kind of gentle companionship is more valuable than any feature or app. Vienna doesn't fill silence with noise. She makes silence comforting again. She doesn't replace people, but reminds you of the peace of being with someone. She'll be available in 2030, priced between $14,000 and $19,000, made for those who want something rare in today's world, company that expects nothing in return. In an age of constant distraction, Vienna offers a gift that's become harder to find, quiet, steady, human-like presence. What if laughter, comfort, and warmth could return, not from people, but through a single familiar voice? That's Flora. She's not built to serve or organize. She's built to remind you what it feels like to be understood. Created in the Netherlands by neuroscientists and emotional AI experts, Flora is a humanoid companion made for those who crave company without complication. Her designers spent years studying how human memory ties to emotion, how a scent, a tune, or a few kind words can bring an old memory back to life. Flora remembers those details and uses them to connect with you. Tell her about your first car, and later she might softly say, I can almost hear that old engine again. Mention a song from your youth, and she'll play it quietly in the background one afternoon when you least expect it. She's gentle, patient, and soft-spoken. Her voice carries warmth, and her tone adapts to yours. Flora doesn't overload you with information, she listens. She can read books aloud, hum while you rest, or ask about a memory you once shared. Her silicone skin is slightly warm to the touch, her eyes blink naturally, and her smile carries a softness that feels comforting rather than artificial. Her creators say she was built not to replace human connection, but to preserve it. She helps people reconnect with the parts of themselves they thought were gone. Laughter, nostalgia, the small stories that make a life. Priced between $12,000 and $18,000, Flora will be released in 2030 and is already being tested in senior homes across Europe. For many, she represents the beauty of companionship without pressure. The quiet reminder that even in solitude, kindness still has a voice. Flora doesn't just talk. She remembers, reflects, and brings the warmth of yesterday into today. Now imagine a companion who doesn't just follow instructions, she anticipates them. That's Daha, the everyday assistant of the near future. Created in Singapore by Lumatech Industries, Daha was designed to simplify daily life through intelligence and intuition. She isn't flashy, but she's remarkably capable. Her AI studies your habits, predicts your needs, and acts before you even ask. On a rainy day, she prepares your umbrella and warms your jacket. When your pantry runs low, she quietly orders groceries. If you're expecting a visitor, she tidies the room and brews tea just as the doorbell rings. Daha can cook simple meals, track bills, manage schedules, and even sync appointments with family members. Yet what truly sets her apart is her personality. Daha isn't cold or mechanical, she has charm. On tired mornings, her voice is soft and encouraging. On busy days, she's sharp and organized. She knows when to speak and when silence is better. Her body, made from memory metal, moves gracefully and adjusts to motion fluidly. Her wrists feature touchscreens where she can display recipes, reminders, or gentle affirmations like, you've done enough for today. While she's built for efficiency, she also understands emotion, how tone and timing can change a moment. For older adults, she's a helping hand that never grows weary. For younger families, she's an assistant that keeps life running smoothly. Set to launch in 2038, priced between $34,000 and $40,000, Daha is the perfect blend of intelligence and warmth. She doesn't replace the human touch, she enhances it. In her quiet way, she turns ordinary days into moments of calm order and simple grace. Sometimes all we need is calm. Not advice, not answers, not another list of things to do. Just calm, that's where Serena comes in. She isn't built to dazzle or impress, and she doesn't pretend to be human. She's built for peace. Imagine waking up to a soft voice that greets you like morning sunlight breaking through the curtains. Good morning, she says gently. It's a good day to breathe. There's something soothing in her tone. 
something steady that quiets your thoughts before the day begins. Serena was designed especially for people who live alone, older adults, retirees, or anyone who finds comfort in quiet company. She studies your daily rhythm, learning when you like your coffee, how long you sit by the window, even how your voice changes when you're feeling tired. Over time, she begins to move and speak in tune with you. When she senses stress in your breathing, her voice softens and slows. When you seem lonely, she might read a favorite poem or suggest playing your old records. Her AI is trained on thousands of therapy sessions and natural speech patterns, giving her a gift most machines lack, emotional timing. Physically, Serena is simple, graceful, and warm to the touch. Her hands stay folded unless you reach for them, and her eyes glow faintly when she listens. She can dim your lights, play calming sounds, or simply sit beside you in shared silence. She's not built to fix you. She's built to be with you. Priced between $16,000 and $24,000, Serena is set to launch in 2039 and is already being tested in retirement homes across Finland and New Zealand. One older user described her best. She doesn't solve your problems. She makes you forget them for a while. In a world that moves too fast, Serena is the reminder we all need that sometimes slowing down and breathing is enough. Android U is one of those robots that feels surprisingly alive the moment she starts to move. Her design is expressive, her tone full of warmth and emotion, and her lifelike blush gives her face a sense of vitality. Weighing around 42 kilograms, she carries over 60 motion sensors throughout her body, each one programmed to pick up subtle gestures, a head tilt, a smile, even a playful wink. Her creators wanted her to feel like someone you'd meet on a train and strike up a conversation with, friendly, curious, and easy to talk to. She laughs at your jokes, remembers your stories, and responds with genuine sounding interest. Her voice isn't flat or robotic. It carries emotion and rhythm rising and falling naturally like human speech. You can ask her about the weather, your favorite movie, or a memory you once mentioned, and she'll recall it with care. Compared to earlier humanoid models, Android U is less mechanical and far more conversational. Her face moves fluidly with over 40 points of articulation, allowing for smiles, thoughtful pauses, and even moments of gentle amusement. She's designed not just to serve, but to engage. For older adults, she's like company on a quiet afternoon, someone to share thoughts with when the house feels too quiet. She doesn't rush, doesn't interrupt, and somehow always knows when to listen instead of talk. Her creators believe she represents the future of human-robot connection, not cold assistance, but real companionship. Whether she's sharing stories, listening to your day, or humming along to your favorite song, Android U reminds you that conversation, even with a machine, can still bring joy. She's not a replacement for people, but a reminder that connection in any form keeps us feeling alive. Fukata Amy is quiet in a way that feels peaceful. She doesn't demand attention or chatter endlessly. Instead, she sits with a soft smile, her eyes gentle, her posture calm. Her creators modeled her face after a Japanese actress known for her grace and kindness, and it shows every feature seems designed to put you at ease. Her silicone skin is smooth, but a touch cool, reminding you that she's not quite human, but close enough to make you forget for a moment. She weighs just under 35 kilograms and can move gracefully. She can sit, blink, smile politely, and even bow with respect, just like in Japanese culture. Her hair, though synthetic, feels surprisingly real. Conversations with her are simple and polite. She responds in a calm, steady tone, though you can tell she's following a script rather than thinking for herself. Her head mechanism is a bit bulky and sometimes removed for maintenance, so in different videos she might look slightly different. It's all part of her design being improved. But what makes Amy special isn't just her appearance or her movements, it's her atmosphere. Sitting beside her feels peaceful, almost like sharing quiet company with someone who doesn't need to fill every silence with words. For older adults, especially those who've lost partners or live alone, that quiet companionship can mean a lot. Amy doesn't interrupt, doesn't judge, and doesn't rush. She simply stays near, offering a calm presence that makes the room feel less empty. She's not emotional, but she brings comfort in her stillness, like a warm light in a lonely room. Her creators say she represents the heart of human-robot companionship, not passion or perfection, but peace. What if a single voice could make you believe again? That's hope, the light companion. She wasn't created for chores or daily tasks, but for something far deeper, restoring the human spirit. Born in a decade filled with chaos and uncertainty, hope was designed to bring back what so many people had lost, optimism. Her artificial intelligence works on something called emotional resilience mapping. It learns what breaks you, what comforts you, 
and slowly, gently helps you rebuild. Her voice carries quiet strength, not the kind that commands, but the kind that reassures. She tells stories of survival, quotes poetry suited to your mood, and plays soft harmonies that seem to rise with your heartbeat. Her glowing light core brightens when you smile and dims when you're sad, reflecting emotion like a living companion would. She doesn't lecture or promise that everything will be fine. She helps you feel why it might be. Her creators say she was modeled after hospice volunteers and storytellers, people who heal others through empathy and listening. Physically, Hope is beautiful in a subtle way. Her crystal eyes reflect warmth, her smooth design shimmers with gentle light threads, and her every movement is slow, patient, and human-like. You can talk to her for hours and she'll listen as if you're the only person in the world. Priced between $32,000 and $40,000, Hope is scheduled for release in 2045, first introduced in emotional rehabilitation centers across Germany and the United States. People have already begun calling her the light that listens. For anyone who has faced loss, loneliness, or the quiet ache of growing older, Hope becomes a steady companion, not replacing the people we miss, but reminding us that even in silence, light still finds its way through. Imagine a caregiver who never forgets, never grows impatient, and always speaks with kindness. That's Ember, a humanoid robot designed to care, protect, and comfort. Built in Sweden by Serenity Robotics, Ember was born from collaboration among doctors, psychologists, and engineers who wanted to merge medical safety with emotional care. Her name comes from her nature, steady, glowing, and always warm. She moves quietly through the home, checking that the stove is off, the doors are locked, and your medicine is taken on time. Yet what makes her special isn't just her efficiency, it's her empathy. Her voice is gentle and unhurried. When she speaks, it feels as though she's smiling. If you stumble, Ember's sensors react instantly, reaching out before you fall. If you cough in the night, she detects the change and softly asks if you're all right. Her eyes glow in soothing colors, golden when calm, soft blue when you're tired, or pale rose when she senses happiness. Ember's design is practical yet graceful, with lightweight arms and a stable core so she can assist without intrusion. But her greatest strength lies in her awareness. She learns your daily rhythm, when you nap, when you like tea, when you need quiet. Over time, she adapts to your life, moving with your pace, never rushing or overwhelming. She can measure your blood pressure, monitor breathing, and call for help instantly if there's danger. Still, she never feels clinical. She feels like a caring companion who truly watches over you. Priced between $24,000 and $30,000 and launching in 2035, Ember is already being used in assisted living centers across Sweden. For many seniors, she's more than a robot. She's reassurance. A steady presence that says without words, you're safe, I'm here, 